What's up, y'all? So Crystal, Jazz, Race Away, Bill, and Deja go off on Chris for this. So Chris chose violence and basically about to fall out with everybody or has fallen out with everybody. So we about to tap into this video, man. This shit is so petty. Y'all make sure y'all check out the last three videos on this. Let's get it. Yeah. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying, and what the goddamn hell you lead. Remember, always introduce yourself with what the goddamn hell yeah. okay? Then we can get into it, all right? League members got to be a part of the lingua, you know what I'm saying? So let's get into this. So I already read the title. No music. Oh, music the whole time. No, ma'am. All right. So, Jazz. Let me slide this off. Jazz said he called security last night because he was finna get jumped. Okay, that's how we starting. On my son, Chris ass is a B I T C H. I literally told his ass to. I, I literally told his ass to his face that he was a B A N. And a, a, a actual harasser, okay? Better yet, rapey as fuck. <laughs> uh, STG, you wanna out, you wanna out everything in a video? How about you put the fact that when you ask us to come outside, we said no, okay? Flo and Amar was this close until security grabbed my niggas, okay? I hate when people tell half-ass stories and manipulate shit. I'm honestly disappointed. Same nigga that took pictures of me and Flo to send to some females because he needed to let them know he was going to be there because he know his hoes will walk off with us quickly. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's terrible. All right. The crazy part is we never said. And y'all y'all can see on the screen who, who said this. All right. The crazy part is we never said that. And I just, I just ft this nigga and let him know he lame oh facetime this nigga and let him know he lame and lost all my respect just say you mad because motherfuckers don't want to fuck with you who who the fuck presses somebody to fuck with them right it's never that deep we told this nigga don't come multiple times i believe that um he tried to make it seem like you've been talking ish about jazz and crystal and shit and being they face you literally hate flow because every itch you want it, want it flow. Tell them what the pressure really about. Well, he did. Uh, because they done told this man five times, no sarcasm. They don't F with him. Why keep trying to force them to F with you? If somebody don't want to F with you, with me, I'm letting shit be. You can't make them F with you. Facts though. That's why I said he had to just take the L. Then bragging, bringing me and Lindasia into shit is weird as weird as fuck right yeah the real shit yeah facts i know I, it sounds like i can't read but hell they, when they type like this y'all we get to sound illiterate i don't know what to say. uh nigga was heated because i ain't want him in my section nigga it's mine i bought it if i don't want you in that motherfucker that's what it is facts you're rapey every female say they uncomfortable around you and all you do is be forceful i don't want no nigga around me that gotta beg for pussy not only that i don't want no nigga around me that's being forceful with women you know because birds of a feather flock together you ain't about to put that on me uh crystal said i don't even do internet ish but don't put no situation that happened in person on the internet because when you seen me and I talked to you dirty, the first thing you did was get go get security because your words. I know y'all gonna jump me. I don't know no nigga that's gonna let you openly call him a rapist and a itch in front of everybody and not say nothing unless it's true. Nah, facts. And I don't take disrespect lightly. I'm still up. Ain't shit stopping nothing. Oh, her birthday is still up. I'm saying no, all this shady, uh, all this shady, a behind the scenes talking. Who gonna say something to me for real? Y'all wanna be internet? <clears throat> I will in each and every single one of you in this blue app tonight. Keep playing with me. Beg and pay, bay niggas was heated cause I ain't want him in my section. Nigga, it's mine. I bought it. If I don't want you in that motherfucker, beg and pay, bay. 
Um, Chris, I'm a nobody itch. You've been here longer than me and I done made more bookings in your ish than you. What the F you get booked for Instagram reels? There's no T. Literally, he's delusional. Only T was me and Jazz was f few effing with each other but i'm pretty so i'm pretty sure i guess the world know that <laughs> if i wasn't who i was definitely wouldn't be asking niggas to grab their duck for instagram views what not to mention itch you came for me you gotta know i go too far she do though she one of them that you gotta kind of just leave alone chris and i was Chris and I has gotten into it multiple times. This isn't our first rodeo. Do not remember that Red Bull getting thrown in your face in Miami. Let's not. Lord have mercy. Why go somewhere you not invited? Why go somewhere where people do not like you? We sat in the same house and told you to your face, do not show up. Oh, you stupid. You simply said they're going to have to tell me to my face one more time. They don't F with me. How many times you need to know? And why are these motherfuckers doing the same videos as us? Like, are y'all effing dumb? It's so much ish going on. I'm finna GTS. Mm. Uh, Halloween. Darren got a party. Uh, it's the fact they tried to do the, it the day before. Like, they started it. Messy shit. I don't like when Kiana and Ray are involved. Because I can't pick sides. I feel that person. I know you're not talking about Kiana. And is like why be so why be messy about everything? God damn! <laughs> All right, time to log off. I am confused now. Literally, we could have been <coughs> on the internet, but for what? See y'all. I would have never knew shit if it wouldn't. Uh huh. Next time I ain't talking. Why go somewhere you not invited? Why go somewhere where people do not like you? Like, nah, for real. That's why I was like, yo, I'm trying to figure out, like, did he know? Did he know that they didn't like him? But, you know, yeah, I watched his video first. So, you know, Jesus Christ. Okay, what is? what are we doing? It's the music for me. All right, Crystal already said these things. Ain't no point in reading that. She literally already said that on live. Um, basically about him being, um, uh, about him being, um, rapey and shit like that. Different since he lost his TikTok. If y'all don't know, it started when he lost his TikTok, then he lost his Instagram, and now he lost his YouTube. And to me, that this is all a way to get his numbers back to what they were. Uh -huh. Now, I'm not saying he doesn't have a right to be upset that his original platforms were taken down right. because it does take a while to build up a platform, especially one that he had That's because he had a lot of numbers. Like, he was doing really good. So, I can imagine that's frustrating, but this is not the way you go about it. And then, like, when he was hanging out with Ray and Lindeja, he would get really mad when Lindeja didn't want to add him to their lives. It was really weird, like, because when Lindeja would add him to their lives, the connection would be bad. So, people were like, don't add him, don't add him. <laughs> now he messing up the connection. <laughs> Why would you want her to add you to the lives when you could just, you know get behind her and appear in the live yourself like it just came off as like trying to hurry up and get his numbers up and then sometimes he would compete with Lindeja and Ray and he's constantly mentioned like well I got this many followers and this many hours nobody doing what I'm doing like I just don't think he was a sour apple from the gate I'm not gonna lie y'all remember I hated his energy I was like yo why he keep talking you know what I'm saying like nothing against him he just I, I didn't like his um uh, I guess it was his aura. And and now that makes sense. You know what I'm saying? I, just, I couldn't get with it. You know, that's why I didn't watch his videos and shit like that. So now that all this is coming out, it makes sense. But you just pissed off all the breadwinners. Are you crazy? And you just lost your channels. Like, are you crazier? You know what I'm saying? He just blew, he just blew his own bag. And not saying like you need them, but you know, clearly you started all this shit. So he should have cleared all this up, you know, um, but this is a mess. None of this is genuine. I think that this is the way for him to get the attention that he yeah. needs. I will say this shit, it didn't sound genuine at all. That's a fact. Get his numbers back up. And it's crazy because I really feel like, um, you know, they really rock with him. Like when Deja basically said she gave him chance after chance. 
you know, Ray let a lot of stuff slide too. Like, I don't know if y'all peep, but in the lives, he actually pushed Ray in one of the lives. You're going to have to go back and look. I'm not sure oh, which man. live it is, but they were kind of like at the bar and they were sitting down. And that was the live where he was like kind of fake choking one day. Just nah, I hate when my like guy friends don't touch me. You know, don't touch me at all, but definitely don't touch me in a, 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 a manly way. You know what I'm saying? Don't touch me. You know, he was really going off, and Ray like stepped in between. And them. don't touch my woman like that, cause that's how niggas like to play dykes with their girls. You ain't playing me, nigga. Don't touch my woman. The fuck is you doing? <laughs> like, like, well, act like they play fight. And that happened to me before when I was younger. Stand with a, uh, stand with a, a, a woman and her dude, me and my girl at the time, and the nigga in the house was play fighting with her. And literally, you know, a man, normally when a man playing with a woman, they grab her from behind. That's what he did. Yeah. Me and the old girl was looking at each other like, yo, ain't no way. It, it ain't no way. Y'all, I, I had to take this shit to my daddy. I felt some type of way. I'm like, yo, what the fuck am I supposed to do? He say, because I had an issue first with him looking at her butt and shit. He say, you going to take a man eyes out of his head? <laughs> I said no he said well you can't do shit about it not as far as that go but a man putting his hands on your woman like that first of all she shouldn't even let that happen that's the lesson that i want to teach y'all a woman should never let that happen if a woman let that happen something wrong with her um, and he like nudged ray really hard like they let a lot of stuff slide before it got to this point so in my opinion, it don't seem like Chris really valued his friendship with them. Like, if they told him to stay home and he wasn't invited to, you know, Jazz's celebration, then stay home. You know, when Ray wasn't getting invited everywhere because a lot of people were rocking with Kiana, she never complained. She didn't. You know, she never got on live and she out. Did, she damn sure ain't bring it to the internet, friend. That's a fact. She did not bring it to the internet. People, she just... Because you could tell she wasn't getting invited. That's a fact. You no. Know, Played her role and and sat back and watched. I agree. She didn't she do did. all that, you know. And for a while, she, she wasn't invited to a lot of the major stuff because Kiana was there. She, she did. didn't do all that. Like sometimes you're not going to be invited to everything. That's a fact. Why would you try to have a conversation with Flo at the club about some beef again? How many times I got to tell you I don't like you? You know what I'm saying? I, I should only have to tell you that once. Club celebrating Jazz's birthday. Everybody's been drinking, and nobody wants to have those type of conversations while they celebrating somebody's birthday. Mm -hmm. like, the whole video was real bizarre to me. I don't care I if agree. people don't like it. I know you're gonna have fans that watch this, but it was just really weird to me. Um, I don't think this is worth the attention that he's going to get. In my opinion, it's more negative attention than positive attention, and it made me look at him differently. A lot of people were already complaining that he was kind of like a pervert, but I kind of like. I didn't see it that way because I always felt like he asked the girls, can he grab that? So I didn't he think did. it was anything weird. But that was you know, perverted. Realize, like, there might be something. He definitely asked the girls, but I would agree on how, damn, I was trying not to do that. I would agree on how it can look perverted for sure. Off because he really has a stain for putting his hands on one Deja and being combative with it. Like, he you know, yeah, I'm a slapper. Yeah, I'm a slapper. Yeah, I'm a slapper. Like, and literally would hit her, like. What? You know, Deja would kind of laugh it off or whatever and try to, you know. I had no idea. <laughs> go back and forth with him on some joking stuff. I didn't think it was funny. I don't think no man should be putting his hands on a girl like that. Facts. Especially Lindeja because she's small. Facts. <laughs> and Chris is way bigger than her. Facts. But, um, you know, I don't blame, you know, Jazz, Crystal, Ray, Lindeja for responding because he said some crazy stuff in that video. He did. He tried to come down on Crystal for being just a baby. And it was a lot of whole, like, I'm not going to talk to you. Uh, well, almost like premeditating. I'm not going to talk to them anymore anyway. Like we used to be cool. Used to, used to. So, you know, like I, I, I genuinely feel like he blew it back. And at first I'm like, shit, you know what happened? But now I know, I mean, he the problem. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So he got to go. That's just plain and simple. But y'all let me know how y'all feel down in the comment section below, man. Make sure you greet me with the what the goddamn hell. Yeah. And uh, we on to the next video. Later.